Now, yesterday we brought you the story of the Illinois State Board of Education placing more than 20 schools on probation for not following mask mandates. And one of those was Edwards County Community Unit District 1. Well, today we went to Edwards County and found parents waiting to pick up their kids early from school for one reason. Iowa Just News' Katie Forcade spoke to parents about COVID inside the classrooms. Now we spoke to a parent who says her son is being sent home under quarantine after being told her son was in close contact with somebody who recently caught COVID-19. Take a look. Yeah, my son just said, Mom, are you okay if I, I, might, I might have COVID? And I was like, oh gosh, that's like my worst nightmare. Stacy Brands is a single mom with two kids in school. She says she got a phone call earlier today from the school secretary about her son. He was in close contact with a COVID-19 person. Brand says she was forced to come get her son only after being in the classroom for four days. You know, am I the only one? I didn't know. And then as soon as I got there, I started seeing one after another after another my kids uh, classmates because I recognize their parents and it's just crazy that this is happening. <laughs> Brand saying she's unsure of what will happen next. She knows health officials will be in contact with her about how to proceed. The Edwards County Health Office released a statement saying in part, per IDPH guidelines, once we receive a positive school case, we reach out to the school nurse who then assists us with the contact tracing. Once we get those individuals, we call the parents and let them know that we are asking them to quarantine for the 14 days past exposure per IDPH guidelines. All of this happening just after the school district was placed on probation for not following a statewide mandate asking schools to mask up. We went to an open house and they were like, you know what, they don't have to wear masks. No one has to wear a mask, you know, I don't even have to wear a mask, so, and that, at first I was like, well, that's really nice, you know, because they don't have to worry about it, you know, and, but then in the back of my mind, I was like, is this a joke, you know, like, and it, maybe it's too good to be true. Are you scared for your kid right now? Yeah, I am, because it was like we were fine, and now we're not, you know. Now, parents say they thought summer was over, but now they're going to have to figure out what to do with their kids at home for the next two weeks. In Edwards County, Katie Forcade, Eyewitness News.